You're so good. Come here. Come on. Okay. Okay. Pee on the bed and I kill you. Okay? Look at this. He's so excited about being on the bed because he's not normally allowed on it. <laughs> he better not pee, I swear to God. Oh my god, chill out! Hi everyone, so today I'm here with Bulmer. He's very excited because... Oh my god, I nearly off the bed. He's very excited because he's not normally allowed onto the bed. Come on, thanks. Okay, okay, so before we get started, this is Bulmer. I can never tell if you can actually see him on camera because he's a black dog. He's so hard to capture on camera and I always want to show him off on Instagram and all that kind of stuff. But he's black, you just can't see his face. But I hope you can see him right now. focus my camera is literally can't focus on his face oh there we go he's so cute okay so like i said he's very excited to be in the bed because he's not normally allowed in the bed so i'm just gonna leave him do his thing and you can watch him again sorry now if the lighting is a bit off my light is not working so it's just natural light so that's why i'm very lit over here because i kept the window blah 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 let's go on to tag first question what is your pet's name his name is bulmer um i'm actually going to insert a video i did a video when i first got him um, so I actually made a video back in 2012 when I first got him. Um, he was so cute, so tiny, he was literally like a few weeks, he was like seven weeks or something like that when I first got him. And I remember asking me for um, ideas for a name because I didn't have a name and I kind of had an idea in my head. I wanted it to be like a strong butch male name that no one else kind of had. I came up with Bulmer. Um, Bulmer, I think first, I heard, I heard on Independence Day. I think it's the name of the dog on Independence Day and I just liked it. It was like butch. No one else had it. So Bulmer is his name. Hi everyone. So, um... I just wanted to introduce you to my new little friend and my new member to the family. And this is him. He is um, a pure red pug, as you can see. So this is him. Um, and as you can see, he's tiny. He's a bit curly tail. So, um, <laughs> yeah, this is my new baby. Come and say hello. Can you come and say hello? Okay, so um, I might insert some videos of him doing his thing. So um, thanks for watching. Talk soon. Bye. Um, what kind of pet is he and what breed? As you can see, he's a dog. And breed, he's a pug. He's a purebred pug. I always get questions when I walk and people think he's some sort of bulldog and stuff because pug, pugs are quite rare. Um, well, more popular now because they're obsessed. Oh yeah, have you noticed time with pug theme today? Um, so yeah, he's a purebred pug. Um, how, long have you had, how long have you had your pet friend? I've had him for four years. I made that video in 2012. So he's actually just gone four. Um, how did you get your pet? I bought him from um, a lovely lady in Dublin. She had pugs herself and she's a huge pug lover. Really, like when I visited the house, I could really tell that she was just such an animal lover. Very caring, very homely, lovely, warm woman. And I could see these dogs were well taken care of and that's where I purchased Bulmer from. So I actually traveled up the country to get him because like I said, they're not hugely popular or available in Ireland. So I traveled to get him. Um, how old is your pet? I think I said that already, he is four. What are some quirky things about your pet's personality? Um, so Bull is extremely loyal. I know people say dogs are loyal in general, but this dog does not leave my side. Literally, he'll be walking around beside me all day long, will not leave my side. 
Um, this one's not really quirky. He barks more at men than women. I don't know why, but he definitely barks and queries men way more than women. I'm not sure what it is. It's not even, even if a tall woman came, he wouldn't bark as much as if a small man came. It's really weird. He just kind of senses male and barks. I don't know why. Um, he absolutely hates the rain. He like looks so pissed off when it's raining. To the point like if I'm bringing him for a walk, he will walk around the puddles. He hates getting his feet wet. It's so funny. I don't know if other dogs are like this or not, but he absolutely hates getting his feet wet. And he's so pissed when it's raining. And snow, don't, he doesn't want to know about. Don't even talk to me about snow. Um, what else quirky things does he do? He loves to fart, which is bad. Um, he's very grunty and snuffy, not snuffy, snorty. Um, but pugs are generally like that because their nose is squished in, they don't have a long snout. They tend to snort a lot, which is hilarious. Um, what else about you? I don't know, he's very, really laid back. He's very chill. He's either extremely chill or really, really hyper. As a pup, he was really, really playful, really hyper and giddy. Um, he's after calming down now a lot and he's very chill and relaxed. Um, and you can tell, like, he does facial expression, expressions. Pugs are known to be kind of, um, looking pissed off all the time but when he's happy it looks like he's smiling even though he's, he looks like he's pissed off all the time it's weird um i think that's all of his quirks what else is quirk what else is quirky about you i don't know i'll think more um what does your relationship with your pet mean to you like i'm not one of those huge stuffy people like oh my god my dog is my life blah, blah, blah. of course i love him he means the world to me he's amazing he keeps me company if i'm down he'll sit by my side um, but all in all, it's just a companion. He's so cute, he's so playful, he's just, I love him. I love him. Um, what are some of your favorite pastimes with your pet? So Bulmer is quite lazy. Pugs in general are quite, like I said, chill, but you don't actually have to exercise them that much. Of course I do exercise my walk and maybe a few days, but the thing with pugs is that they do have cardiovascular problems and respiratory pro problems, which is why I was kind of, drawn to getting a pug because I myself am asthmatic so I have um, lung issues as do pugs so I feel like we kind of bond in that so you can't take him on walks that are too long because he'll get too tired um, which kind of sends me to let down to the ground so favorite pastimes with my pet like we like walking together but we get tired very easily and we always walk behind me on the lead if you ever follow me on snapchat you'll see he's just this thing he'll always walk by my feet or behind me he'll never walk in front of me always behind me um, and once he's had enough, he'll just stop. He'll just stop walking. So, walking is our only path. I think we prefer lying down than walking, to be honest, as a pastime. Um, last question, this is really quick. What are nicknames that you call your pet? Uh, Bull. I call him Bull, just for short. Um, yeah, just Bull. <laughs> so those are all the questions. Just the tag, I hope you enjoyed this video. It's a very laid back video. I'm not wearing any makeup or anything today. Um, I hadn't planned on filming, that's what I mean basically. Um, so yeah, just kind of a once off. People always ask questions about him and I wanted to show him off again. So I will insert more clips of when he was a pup and kind of more pictures of now recently. But yeah, this is my Bulmer. So thank you so much for watching. If you have a pug, let me know and we can bond over our pugginess. Um, any questions about pugs or about Bulmer or about anything, just leave them below and I will see you in the next one. Bye.